Hey guys, it's your girl Missy back at it again with another Dollar Tree haul for you all. So first and foremost, I just want to say I'm not dead. I know I haven't put out a video for over a month and I sincerely apologize for that. Just life and work has been completely hectic for me. And to top it off, tis the season that everybody's getting married or having birthdays. And I also bake cakes and decorate cakes and stuff for poops and giggles on the side. So... I am so sorry that I have not given you guys a video, but I'm back. Hopefully I can get back to doing the weekly videos. And the video I promised last time about a month ago was I was gonna show you guys that eyeshadow palette. So I will be doing that. So stay tuned for that. But let's go ahead and get started with the Dollar Tree haul since I traveled down to Salt Lake today and hit up a Dollar Tree store that I have I was blown away and I got a lot of really neat stuff. Some of these are going to be repeats from other YouTubers because I have not found these items up here in the Northern Utah area. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get started. So Mother's Day is right around the corner. And honestly, if you guys want to get some really bomb cards, just some awesome cards for those sweet, magnificent mothers in your life, definitely hit up the Dollar Tree because they have what looks to be like handcrafted cards and these ones are just wonderful they're three-dimensional they have extra little ribbons and bows and stickers and all that other fun stuff and glitter most people hate glitter i love glitter so they are these cards are magnificent sorry mom if you're going to be seeing this before mother's day one of these go to you um but yeah so it's from the company of voila and they actually give some of the best cards uh, out at the Dollar Tree. Not give them, sorry. You have to purchase them. But they have some of the best cards at the Dollar Tree, especially around Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, Father's Day, like those ones where you want nice, sweet cards. The Dollar Tree is your place to go. So I picked up two cards, one for my mom, one for my sister-in-law. Got those for him. I also found this cute little uh, glass plaque thing for my mother too and it says all that I owe or all that I am I owe to my mother don't know if that's a good thing or not but it is true so I got this for her, but then when I got it home I realized that it is crooked and it might have also just been broken I'm just kidding it's not uh, but it is crooked so hopefully our OCD don't make me wanna because my mom has OCD as well so hopefully she can just put it up on a shelf far, far away and won't be able to see it. Okay, so the next thing I found were these embroidery, embroidery uh, pour la mason. I'm not French, but basically it's 100 French designs for the home. And you can just see on the cover, it's just kind of little embroidery things. Um, I'll just show you some quick little cutouts of this. So if you have women in your life that love to hand embroider things, you can see here there's like cute little blow dryers and all that other fun stuff. There's tons of things in here, um, but you can make little makeup bags. Look how cute that is. It's the little eye mask that you can make and put little eyelashes on it. So it just gives you guys a little how-to. Let me show you. Sorry. Just kind of... And I apologize that this lighting always kicks off all weird. But it just kind of gives you guys like a how-to of the embroidery. So you can hand embroider things. The next thing I got is uh, Huge and Huggable Mochi Mochis. So this book is 20 supersized patterns for big knitted friends. Um, if I don't knit. I wish I knew how to knit. I definitely don't know how to knit. But this book was actually $21.99 and I found it at my Dollar Tree store. And I'll just show you guys the back. So you can knit little caterpillars. There's a little octopus or a squid. It's a squid, I think. Squid or it's got to be a squid. I'm going to go with squid. And then like a little monster truck. So it kind of just gives you guys little designs and things like that for kids. So you can knit little mochi mochis for kids. There's a pencil. It gives you the directions and all that other stuff on how to do the pencil and all that other stuff. And there's one for a little teddy bear. Anyways, thought that was super cute. Pick that up at my local Dollar Tree. Okay, and also these are gonna be in no random, these are just in random order. So you guys are gonna get randomness. Um, the next little items I have are these little water squirters. One has princesses on it. The other one has the Hulk. My niece loves princesses. My nephew loves the Hulk that he decided that that is his go-to Avengers character. So. I got these for them since summer is right around the corner. 
they love these things because I think they love squirting each other in the face and then one of them cries and you know, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So the next little item I got are these head wraps. Now, these are the very, very nice, stretchy, soft head wraps. And I noticed that they also had bobby pins that were gold and peach. And they also had hair ties like this as well. But I thought these ones were just really pretty, especially since I'm doing the quick videos on like masks and all that other stuff. Um, I wanted to get something a little bit better for me to put my hair up with. So I found these and it's just that really soft, stretchy lace material. Thought those were great. The next thing I got is these gel ball of foot cushions. So these are the gel ones. It says they have a slim design, won't crowd toes, super soft gel, self-adhesive, so it stays into place. So I actually picked up a pair of these for my boyfriend because he says that the balls of his feet hurt all the time because he stands a lot. Um, and I also picked up one, not for myself to use as for my feet, for the balls of my feet, but I actually wanted to do a comparison with the Silly Sponge. If you guys know what that is, it's a silicone face sponge that you use to put your foundation on your face and one of these because it is literally the exact same feel. So I want to compare the two because now you can buy like Silly sponge for Sponges for pretty cheap if you go to like wish.com or aliexpress but in other stores some of them are a little bit more expensive so i figured you know what what the hell let's just figure let's just see if it works let's just try it out because if i can get two for a dollar and it's bigger for my face then let's just try them out and see i know it sounds weird but hey i'm weird so we'll just we'll just go with it just go with it it's easier Okay, the next thing I found was for me, and it's a magnet, and it says, I speak fluent sarcasm. Fitting. Okay. The next little item, you guys know I love little bags like this. I know this is one that goes in a binder, but I really like this one because it says, believe in yourself, and there's two little, little giraffe on there. And I just really like it. I think it's cute. I think it'd be fun for my makeup bags, and I don't care that there are little um, holes in it perfectly fine with me. Okay. The next little item I found was this pain relief ice pack. Does anybody remember these from like the eighties or am I like the only one? And they are a very nice, like thick rubber, like this one's covered in cloth, but the other ones, do you remember hot water bottles, which is probably not what they're called now that I'm thinking of it as an adult, but it was a water bottle that you would put hot water in and it always smelled funny. If you guys know, let me know. If you guys know what I'm talking about, let me know down in the comments below. But anyways, I got one of these. It's just a little ice pack that you would just unscrew. You fill with ice cubes and for cold therapy. So for knees, joint aches, headaches, anything like that. Wonderful. Okay. The next little item that I picked up were these skull vent sticks in the scent of Driven Girl. What? Um, honestly, it just seriously smells like cologne. <laughs> <laughs> but I thought they were kind of cute. They're little skulls and crossbones. Ah, just whatever. Why not? Okay. As you guys all know, my boyfriend Ashton loves the minions. So I was able to pick him up these despicable me bandages and they're pretty cute. It's got little, I don't know which, I don't know what their names are, but you can just see a little despicable me. All right. Next little random hair item that I picked up because I've been doing, been doing like different things with my hair is I found this like gold braided headband that I could put underneath my bangs. I don't know. I don't know how the kids do it these days, but I figured I'd try it out. I don't know. Do you guys like the new hair color? If you can see, if you can tell it is blue, my whole head is blue and everything is blue. My neck is blue. My fingers are blue. It's awesome. Okay. So the next little item I have are these shoe liners. Now they are women's shoe liners. They're just little ones, um, little thin guys. I got it in the color of gray and they have these in a multitude of colors, gray, blue, black, pink, purple, red, orange, yellow, like your neons. They have all those. I just wanted to test those out because sometimes little short socks slip off my feet. Okay. The next little item I found, I was really happy to find this. It's the Rimmel London Keep Calm and Lip Balm. Um, this is just in the color of clear and I think it's just for moisturizing and the front of it says keep calm and love. Sorry if you can't see that. Keep calm and love. 
but I got this and I hope it is good. I've been using the Rimmel on my face and I've really, really liked it. So hopefully their lipstick or lip gloss is the exact same. Okay. The next little item that I picked up is this Aerofoam Luscious Pear Foaming Hand Wash. Um, I really like foaming hand lotion for some reason. I have no idea why. Uh, but it just says it's dye free and it's infused with botanicals. So hopefully this is good. This would, if it is good, this would be a fun little gift you can also give away for the mothers in your life as well. Because I know people like to receive soap. I do. I like getting them receiving soap. Okay. So the next little item I have is this cute little sign that says "Hello, gorgeous." And I know this is a repeat. I know these have been out for a very long time, but this is the one I have been looking for. For so long and so I'm so glad that I found it because as you can see everything behind me is black and gold so this is black and gold and it is going in my office and I'm super excited for that Whew, so happy I found it okay the next little item I have is an inspirational magnet and it says kind heart fierce mind brave spirit and I got this for my sister best friend Nicole because she loves arrows and this just defines her to a T. So I got this for you. Um, but yeah, so I got that. She can probably just put it on a filing cabinet at work or something. Figured why not. Okay, everybody's been getting these. It's the Revlon Perf Perfumier, Parfumier, whatever. It is the Nell color. I got this in the hot pink color, which is African Tea Rose. So I got that bright pink to put on my toesies. So I got it for my toes for this summer because I like putting bright colors on my toes. Okay. The next little item I have is, I'm going to say it's called Elef, Elage, I don't know, Elage, E-L-A-J. Anyway, it is eczema relief. It's um, oatmeal skin protectant. So I got this because my skin has been getting really bad dry patches on it, which is why I ended up switching my foundation. Um, I also have been getting dry patches on my upper arm area and I don't know if it's eczema or anything. I do have an appointment with a dermatologist, uh, in August, so I have to wait a little while, but I do have one. So I just wanted to kind of test this out and see if it even works, especially on the dry patches on my arms. I've had them for a very long time, just right underneath my shoulders here. And they, they bug me and they just get really dry and stuff like that. And as much as I put lotion on, it doesn't seem to go away. So I picked this up at the Dollar Tree. It doesn't actually expire until November of 2017. So November of, of this year. So I'm going to have to try it out soon. Um, and I'll let you guys know if that works or not. And I probably said the name wrong. Okay, the other item I have is this colored lead mechanical pencils. If you guys are into adult coloring, these are awesome. I know they're bright colors, but they're just like a mechanical pencil, like it says, with the colored lead in it. But the great thing is, is you do not have to, I'll show you guys, see how tiny that is? You wouldn't have to sharpen these over and over and over again. So that's wonderful. It comes with eight colors, I believe and it comes with a variety of them. So if you guys are into adult coloring books, these are your go-to, those are awesome. Okay, the next two little items that I have here are for work. Um, they are a pack of post-it notes. One of them says, stop wishing, start doing, and it's just got little stripes on it. The other one says, make today great. And I like using post-it notes like this instead of just regular post-it notes. I don't know why I just do. Okay. The next little item that I have is this fun little bag. I actually picked this one up so I could put it in my backpack when I go hiking. I'm actually going to make this a first aid kit. And with that being said, I actually picked up a little first aid kit that will fit in here nice and snug. It's also not just going to have, cause I believe this is just basically two antiseptic towelettes and mostly band-aids. That's it. Two antiseptic towelettes and band-aids and a hard uh, hard case so with the hard case i'm actually going to be putting in things that i don't want to get wet um and then like the band-aids and things like that and then on the other side i'm going to be putting like an ace bandage um like you know in case something needs to get sewn like you know if you need a quick stitch or something like that i'm gonna have all that stuff 
in this bag so I can just take it with me when I go hiking or paddle boarding and stuff this summer. Okay. I've only got four items left and two of those items are books. Um, as much as I say, I haven't really been reading. I really haven't been reading. I am a 90 percenter. I get almost all the way through a book and then I stop reading it. I have no idea why that is. So the first, so we're just going to continue that trend, shall we? So the what, first one I got is from Robin Waz, Waz, Wazerman, Wazerman, probably slaughtering it like I always do. So this one is the Seven Deadly Sins book. Honestly, I didn't pick it up because I thought it was going to be something like saucy and sultry or anything like that. I literally bought this book because right when I opened it up, it had my name in it. There's a character in here that has my actual name in it. So spoiler alert. My real name's not Missy. So anywho, but yeah, so I was looking at it and I'm like, oh my goodness, my name's in here. So I'm going to read a book that has my name in it and then make it about me. <laughs> okay. And the other one I got is from Eric Prince, founder and former CEO of Blackwater Inc. It's called Civilian Warriors, the inside story of Blackwater and the unsung heroes of the war on terror. I actually picked this up for my boyfriend Ashton because I just thought he would actually like this book. So we'll see. We'll see if he does. Okay. And second to last item is the one thing I have been looking for for so long. I know that everybody has seen these. Everybody has hauled them. I am so excited for this because I got one for my niece and nephew. And I also got one for my cat because I think my cat would be entertained by this. And it is the whale bubble machine. Yes, the whale bubble machine. I am 30 years old and I buy my cat bubble machines. Might need some help. Okay, and last but definitely not least, an item that I was actually really, really, really excited to find. And this is the wide angle smartphone lens. You guys have seen these. If you guys go on wish.com or AliExpress, these are on there all the time. And basically all it is, is it works with any smartphone, easy to use. You just clip it on your phone and I'll show you guys on there the before and the after. As you can see, here's the before with little Timmy, Mary, John, and Jane. And you can see that little Timmy and little Jane have been cut off. And then with this little lens, it puts them back in the picture. So we shall see if this little wide angle lens works. And I am super excited to test it out. So that is it. My little black box of goodies has been emptied. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have not subscribed to my channel, please do so. If you guys would, go ahead and like up this video because it is free. And until next time, see you guys.